Reggie, the highest honor that any franchise can give to a player is to retire his number. But here in Indiana, as Mark mentioned, we've reserved that for only the best of the best. George, Mel, Roger, and Bobby Leonard. You know, those guys won three ABA championships, and they were the heart and soul of those teams. You are the first NBA player whose jersey will be retired. You catapulted us during your career into the elite of the NBA. You know, five Eastern Conference Finals, an NBA Final. You own every record, almost every record, in our record book. But beyond that, you've been the consummate professional. You've been a great teammate, as evidenced by all the players who've come back. And you've been a great community citizen. You have been the heart and soul of this franchise for 18 years, and number 31... And number 31 deserves to go up with the best of the best. I'm going to ask Slick, the representatives of Mel and Roger and George to come up here and help unveil this replica jersey. You're in their company. Reggie, I was honored to be here for your draft day. I'm even more honored to be here taking part in the ceremony. Thanks for everything. Thank you very much. In my 18 years coming from Riverside, California, I never imagined that I would earn, and I say that term, earn my way into anyone's rafters. To be alongside these Indiana greats, George McGinnis, in my opinion, the best athlete ever the Donna Pacer uniform, Roger Brown. My favorite uncle in the world who I love, who couldn't be here, Uncle Mel Daniels. And obviously, Mr. Boom Baby himself, Slick Leonard. Thank you guys very much for this unbelievable honor. You know, Obviously, there's a lot of thank yous that can go around, and I um, apologize if I don't mention everyone, but you got to start at the head of the list. Obviously, Herb and Mel Simon and the Simon family. 
for always trusting Larry Bird and Donnie Walsh and Donnie. Who would have knew? Rick Fusion, who and his staff, I thought last April when they did that nice event against Chicago was nice, but Rick, your staff obviously has outdone themselves again with this, so thank you very much. Now, for 18 years, I've been a part of the Pacer family. I really, I know that they were introduced before, but I want to take the time to introduce my real starting five and my real family to you guys. My eldest brother, Saul Jr. Daryl. I think you know her, Cheryl Miller. Thank you. And the baby, Tammy. I'd really like to thank Coach Rick Carlisle and Jermaine, the captain, and the present players. More importantly, you see a lot of these guys that are sitting down beside me. They talk about me being the heart and soul. There's no way I could have done what I did without all these guys that are behind me. And last but not least, it will say Miller up in the jersey, but the reason why I wanted to introduce my family it really will be the Miller family going up. And I just want to thank you guys for everything you've done for me in 18 years and taking care of me coming here from California. Thank you very much. Let's see, uh, let's see, Reg, if you got enough oop left in those old bones to raise a banner. Until now, four people had been honored with their numbers raised to the rafters here at Conseco Fieldhouse. And tonight, a fifth is honored. Reggie, this is your time. Have fun. George McGinnis, Mel Daniels, Roger Brown, and Bobby Slick Leonard move over from tonight on, you got company up there. <laughs>